1965, January, I came home from Saturday uh, Sunday school, or if you will, Catholic catechism school, to find my father lying on the ground in our driveway. It was a little unusual. He didn't usually spend much time lying on the ground in our driveway. It turns out that he had fallen from the roof while shoveling snow off the roof to protect it from ice buildup. And in the process, had broken both legs. Ambulance showed up moments after I arrived home, took him to the hospital, and he was there for close to a month. Some complications added to his hospital stay. He was home, not working, for almost nine months that year, recovering from having two broken legs. And what was important about that time for me is that I got to know him better. He decided to build an electronics kit with hundreds of parts, diodes and transistors and, oh, I have no idea, screws and nuts and bolts. And he built a radio, not a radio, it was a, an, uh, an AM FM tuner to go with his hi-fi stereo system, hundreds of parts. And I helped him a little bit every day, learned patience, I learned about being methodical, and more than anything else, since I tipped over the parts bin more than once, I learned about being gracious and containing one's anger because, oh, he had the opportunities but he never did. He never once got angry, despite all the opportunities he had. So I learned a great deal from my dad that year. It was a really good year.